Sports Illustrated magazine came out one time in, in the summer of that 68 and and it had an article about what the, the well-dressed golfers were and it had Doug Sanders the professional golfer from Texas and Jerry Rodehavers the amateur golfer from Kansas and it had what the, it had pictures of them of the clothes that they wore and Rhoda had had shoes that matched every outfit he had of course he owned the clothing store in downtown Wichita or Topeka and and he had clothes that matched and, and everything he had everything he had was he had shoes that he'd wear that were street shoes had shoes just like them they had cleats on them that he changed and he'd have the same shoes on except they had cleats on so he had two two pair of shoes he had shoes that matched everything so that's the way Jerry read and so one day we're, we're talking at the country club there at Topeka Country Club and, and everybody was kidding him about it and I said say how about coming over to Shawnee and playing next week, Jerry? And he said, what for? And I said, well, I, I, I want to show you how, you know, over here where the high-class golfers think they are. And I said, you ought to go over there where the, where the real people that play golf. And I said, it's not the clothes they have on, it's how, how, what kind of person they are and, and what kind of golfer they are and everything. And he said, okay, well, and so I invited a couple of friends to come along too end up with a, a five so and and anyway so I told all the guys I said just wear crappy old clothes that you look look like hell and and uh, and I told Rhoda Haver I said you're coming over and you're gonna see how real golfers dress instead of trying to dress pretty and stuff like this and fancy so uh, Anyway, so Rhoda Haver showed up and Chuck Valley and, and me from the Pika Country Club and, and, and uh, Ted Waldemuth, an old friend of mine, and Dick Friend, another good friend of mine, played. And I had, uh, I had bib overalls on and, and, uh, and everybody had, uh, Dick Friend had some torn shirt and stuff on and, and uh, Chuck Valley had, his clothes were all torn and I had, but I had those, Overall coveralls on, and and it looked like just off the farm, and, and uh, anyway, there we were going down the fairway, and uh, somebody from uh, told the Topeka Capital Journal about it, and so they sent a photographer out there, and he took the picture of us coming down the fairway, five of us, and and uh, said the article said something about that uh, here's the well best dressed golfer in the golfing world for amateur plays with different kind of guys when he's at home. <laughs> and anyway, anyway we, we had a lot of fun with him, teasing him all the time because he was, he was just so prissy about what he wore all the time.